We are back. We are back. We are back. What's good? What's good? It's your boy. It's your boy. It's your Did you miss me? Did you miss me? Did you miss me? What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Toshi. You know what time it is, man. We about to get into this heat. I've been real busy lately doing some real life shit. You already know me, man. Doing dance shit. Doing real life shit. Trying to figure out life. I gotta move. In February. So, you know, that's always a situation. There's a lot going on. What? I'm here. So if you're just now catching this on YouTube, you already know, man. Go ahead and drop that follow, comment, and sub. All of the above, you feel me? Now let's get into it. Okay, let's get it. Hawkeye, season one, episode three. Check it out. 2007. Wow, she can't hear anything. Damn, every time she turns around. So she was smart. Very smart, but couldn't even hear. So she's daredevil over here, but with ears, without being deaf. That makes sense, because she's like Boji. Oh shit, she got one leg too? She deaf and got one leg? Okay, so she saw stuff with it. That's what sucks is that she can't hear any of this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. The Ronin pulled up. Embodied everybody. Wow. I mean, so she got her purpose. I'd be mad, too. That's what you walked in on? Hell, yeah. Mm, nice intro. Gave us a backstory. <laughs> Better figure it out. Or try to. If you just get a little tear in the duct tape, you might be able to just like, yay. But it just depends on how you uh, tie it up. Not the motherfucker throwing a big ass teddy bear. Ooh, let's go with the one leg. Smooth with it. Motherfucker. And just stumbled upon it. My guy is skilled, bruh. Look at the skills. Come on. <laughs> oh, not the foot. <laughs> she just whooping up on one dude. He over here smacking everybody. Ah, the hand to the wall. Okay, nice. Sit your ass back down. <laughs> that motherfuckers grabbed the truck. Look how that was filmed. Nice. <laughs> the Christmas chase music. Nice. It's just like somebody's in the back seat whipping with him. Well, she just bodied. Oh, did she just body two people? Like, <laughs> I wonder what that arrow is used for. Sort of plunger arrow. <laughs> ah. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> Motherfucker came back up. Acid arrows. Let's go. That's kind of crazy. I really want to know what that plunger one is for. Gotta have a reason. Hmm? Him! Oh! <laughs> oh, that was cold! Bro, that was cold! This is what the sticky arrow's for? Oh, this is a different, oh, this is a different arrow. That's what the sticky aerial's for. <laughs> that shit's just ultra sticky. He's gonna need a new earpiece. 
Mm, look at that. Nice connection. Mm. There it is. There's the bond. <laughs> Trust a bro. Moving company. I didn't even peep that. Mm. She's one of those. Mm. She's just out for revenge. He tuned her out, bro. That's comedy. <laughs> he said, I like that. Pizza dog. <laughs> what does that have to do? Exactly. Okay, so they sneaking into the mom's penthouse. I don't know how, but okay. They got to explain it. They didn't just take the elevator. They just took the elevator? They didn't even sneak in then. Somebody's there. Did you hear that? The door cracked. The door was creaking. Oh, shit. Okay. He pulled up on him with the Ronin sword. Now what? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, Okay. That wasn't that bad. I'm fucking with it, man. It's It has good energy, right? So I like the energy of the show. The characters are cool. It's just a cool little side story, I feel, which hopefully has bigger purpose at the end of the day. But as of right now, it's just kind of like a cool side story, you know, introducing this new character, Kate Bishop. Maybe this will include her into the MCU somehow. Maybe not. Maybe it'll come off as her own spinoff series or show, or maybe she'll continue. I'm not sure, but it, I mean, it's not bad and it's chill for what it is. I wonder how many episodes this season is. Does anybody know? Is it going to be the same as like the other ep other shows that we've seen? Like the WandaVisions and the Lokis and shit? Is it going to be the same amount of, se of uh, episodes? I think it was 10, right? 9? 10? Something like that? It's, it's pretty light. Like, it's just a vibe. Like, it's got dark shit in it, right? Like, motherfuckers is dying. Like, people are dying. Besides that, I mean, it's pretty chill. It's just giving us some cool little Easter eggs and shit like that. You know, like this, the best part of this episode was the the Pym arrow for me. That shit was cold. She, she was like, this is just a regular arrow. He's like, aim high, bring it straight down. And then as it's falling down, he hits that bitch with the Pym arrow. And that shit expands into a big ass, like, come on, bro. That shit is cold, bruh. But that's the one thing about being uh, an archer, though, is that you run out of arrows. Like, bro, your whole, what do they call them? A quill? Uh, I, don't, I don't know arrow terms, but like that little backpack they got with all the arrows in it, you only got a certain amount. And then you asked out and you fighting fist to fist or bow and arrow to, you know, or bow, bow, you just bowing everybody up. But in a fight like that, that shit's useless. Like, you know, that shit's, that shit's pretty funny to me. But I mean, that's all uh, any hero or villain with, you know, the bow and arrow is their specialty. You're, they're gonna run out. So if you can survive long enough to, so they don't hit you, maybe you can catch them on the hand to hand combat game. You know, that's where they're probably at weakest. So even though they might not be really weak there, like, He's, he could fight, obviously. He's not weak. He's skilled swordsman and a skilled with the arrow. But regardless, you know, if you're like the ultimate swordsman versus someone who is like a really good swordsman, you know what I mean? Like, I'll run them arrows for a while, get some sword play in, and you take the dub, you know? <laughs> nah, but good shit, man. It's a, it's a fun, it's fun shit to watch, man. And that was Hawkeye. And there it is. You know what it is, man. I appreciate you. If nobody's told you, I'm going to tell you I appreciate you. Appreciate you for stopping by the stream. Pulling up on your boy. Man, I appreciate you. you just not catching this on YouTube. And as always, have fun, stay fly, and be free. I'm out. <laughs>